Oh, here we go again. It's Oni Village. Manu Oni Village? Stagger Oni Village? Hmm. What do I not want to deal with? Rune, Juno, Atlas be a problem. I feel like Rune's the bigger problem in Oni Village just because of the way how, how fast the core is just going to be naturally going. No Juno either. I do not mind that at all. Do I take advantage of Manu or do I take advantage of Stagger? I think Manu me. Give me a Manu game. Yeah. I'm not helping. Stagger is going to be more, more uh, dependent on if I get hit a lot, which I see a Luna, so I'm going to get hit a lot. Whereas with Manu, I should make a little bit more of a play, possibly. Octavia. Hmm. I think maybe I can run with Manu probably. Yeah, that stairs are on the, uh, it's the same line. So, uh, note as well Luna Strike Shot going. Question marks. Excuse me, I was just chewing on some cherry sours that I got from my last road trip. Shoot Octavia. Don't want to make a play, possibly. I need to be this midfield line for us here. I can't even much of a chance to play the game, unfortunately, yet. But that's just what we need. Ooh, that's very much what we need. And great batboarding, I mean. Because he has switch kits, she gets the chance to just batboard and then reposition herself for just whenever. So that is just immediately what we need. And also, once again, stretch out Luna. I feel like there could be a huge difference in pressure here, but, you know, never doubt a pitch. Tried sniping that out of the way. That was a good try, though. Good wall, Dubu. Now I'm just playing, it's, it's really just playing on and off cooldowns with other era right now. Send it. Here we go. Let's try. Need to do this to get in front of other era, quite frankly. As, as long as we can get the core control, then it's just all about dribbling it with our sword kits. The sword kits versus magnetize for me on, on my era? Yeah, that's what matters. This is what very much so matters. Force the burst out? That's good. I'd send it straight downwards. Didn't work out as I wanted it to. I'm gonna die, so just immediately send, 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 send. Good, 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 good. Guys, if I take any more hits at all, I know I know Octavia's power cord should be coming up anytime soon now, so I'm just not going to risk it. Just go ahead and spend. Cash out, because there's no reason for me to hold on. Good stop. Need to help out here. Even if it just means shrinking air a little bit so I can help out. Pressure-wise. Yeah, keep it down. I was hoping that would hit in case she sent it up. I had the exact right plan, just didn't work out. Alright. Oh, I didn't get to use my butterfly? And uh, uh, my, uh, uh, my magic maelstrom? Come on now. That's a good magic maelstrom, but I just don't have the speed for it yet. A little awkward. That's a pretty nice strike shot, all things considered. Let's keep covering the top, because Dewey already used his rollout, so I need to make sure that I can be there for him, wherever it may go. I'm gonna, gonna maybe die from that hit, so... Use my wife, and just get in their face as much as possible here. Yeah, they, they, you're gonna have to commit if you want to kill me, baby! You're gonna have to commit a lot! Now, Stagger Swagger would be nice here, but beggars can't be choosers. Fact is, I'm still alive, which is all that matters here. This is awkward on so many levels. Oh god, I didn't get hit. Alright, I got an orb. I can play now, baby. I can play and Aimee's doing a great job of maintaining core control. Oh, 
Ah, oh, just auto off. Keep it in the corner. Away from Octavia. Impossible. They both have flip. They cover the top. Cover the bottom now because Dubu rolled out. Ah, uh, I, I should have pressed A more a little bit there. Because I had the right idea to cheap shadowing whichever lane Dubu's not. But I opened, I exposed it a little too much there. Oh well, it's alright. We're on the bat for that an entire time there. Almost salt white. It didn't get Octavia? How? How? Good to preemptive ult. Just keep it out of their hands. Now I just gotta move up with, uh, with, uh, just face with Aimee there. Good two man shrink. I just waited out. Yeah, I'm living. I'm living, nerd. Alright, let's send this immediately upwards. Oh, that was almost it. Alright, I have burst. If it can open, if it, if it can open the lane for us, go ahead and use. Especially if he's spending the strike shots on me. Great force there, and we got the burst too. Now just don't die. Don't die, and this is our win condition. Nice try. Nice try. Should have sent it towards Aimee instead, because the bottom she can at least cover me with my play. Keep sending towards Aimee if possible. Good stuff there. Oh, she kept it on my hands. Need to keep it up. I'm just like, yeah, let, let Octavia time out, and then we go. Good, 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 good play, good play, good play. Because no Octavia is really running on a time limit right there, especially since once again, first set, uh, first set Octavia, you have no boost rates. She's first before I'm your eye. Well, she's gonna get Chrono for free, basically. So what's the next thing then? Quick strike for more energy? Probably. It will bulk. A little bit more damage goes a long way. He's taking aerials. I only take split strides, so Chrono's probably going to be taken by other era, so it's got to be a shot for me then. I mean, 1 2 could make Magic Maelstrom hit harder, especially with Manu, but hot shots is more consistent. Now, prize fighter Luna, do not feed the wind condition. Smile. Don't feed the wind condition. Doing this to just, you know, hopefully stop Octavia stacking. Because we cannot let her continue stacking. We did lose there, and that is a bad ult from her, which is amazing for us. Over the bottom. I am rapidly dying. It didn't get the arrow, though. It's alright. I me. Nice try. Alright, I'm greeting for this orb because I would need it in case I continue getting griefed on the side here. Nice snipe attempt for me. Great hit. Trying to find these weird, uh, like these weird, just immediate vertical angles. Because if I possibly can, uh, it's just. Um, ooh, get timed out on all three of you, you idiots! If I can, I can just immediately cut off a lane and maybe even get a kill, possibly. Because especially with Stagger Swagger, I can't just hope. I can't just like hit them. I uh, hit them slightly with. With the uh, ability, I need to actually just get a full cheese kill out of it. If I want any, if I want any use. Oh, that's unfortunate. Ooh, great stuff! Great stuff! I can't believe you're still alive, I mean. Let's try, Dubu. That was a little bit of a bad force situation for us, unfortunately. And we are fine. Things are going a little bit better, all things considered. A little bit better than I expected it to, considering how, you know, things can be very volatile considering the nature of these team compositions. But don't worry on enough. We'll have to see how things go. Ooh. Oh, if I just let that build for just a second longer, that would have killed all of them, basically. I just missed time slightly. Alright. 
I'm not keeping myself open for any passing lanes is another problem I am dealing with. That's a, uh, that's a, uh, space Octavia kill, though, and that's almost it. Almost, almost, almost. Strength's a little awkward. Okay, strength is very awkward. Let's be, let's be real here, Chief. Just send this one straight, honestly. Oh, I'm shrunk, so I couldn't reach it. I couldn't reach the corners. I'm so small. I'm so small, tiny, and insignificant. All right, burst now. Just send it. Because right. I can... All right, as soon as I get it, Luna um, oh, is one strike away from burst. I just got to end the set right now before it goes. Hmm. Well, I think it's extra special. No Luna, extra special. And, well, that's just more buffer for me with its smile. <laughs> Especially if I hit the core, too. It's even better. Reverb for Maluna. Well, she's getting CDR one way or another with Focus or Reverb. I mean, perfect form. We love to see it. Ego with Octavia. Could be dangerous. She's not. Uh, there's no extensive traits for her, though. So she's not really getting any good flow states. This is the biggest thing. And, all right, she's really not getting, yeah, not getting real, real good flow states at all. Even though she only has one extension trait. And we're really not pressuring her too much towards she's getting the extra speed from uh, Dadger Swagger. So because of that, it's just really what it comes to right now. Thank you, Magic Maelstrom! I should just be dribbling this, honestly. We can give up a barrier. We just can't, can't give up both, of course. This one's gonna hit the corner. Nice try. Ooh. I was greeting for the orb right there because I'm just, you know, one hit away from getting reversed. What matters? Don't be antsy with it. Just be ready to use when you see the chance. Thought I could get a nice head on, but I got it. Because I was expecting it's like, alright, she's either gonna boost or she's just gonna go for it. I was hoping that maybe I could cheese with, you know, Luna's smaller hitbox. Just on the very tip, but she got it. Yikes. I was hoping that we wouldn't have a situation like that. Alright, be aware. That is a Egoist Octavia. Good rollout. Great burst as an anticipation, Dubu. That is fantastic goalkeeping. Now we need to support you because that Magic Maelstrom is scary and I was not ready. I spread too far out after seeing that, that I just didn't mark error immediately after, especially since I already used my Flutterfly. Small mistakes, but, you know, those small mistakes lead into goals anyway, so... It would call it a small one if it cascaded into a, you know, goal loss, all things considered. Alright, give it the bottom. Keep it out of Octavia's hands if we possibly can. If we possibly can. I'm not winning a hit that I want. All right. Send it in the corner. Uh. Octavia Ego is aware. Be patience. Yep, this is just Imi's game now. This is just Imi's app. Yeah, if we, if we can't finish off Octavia, it is a slight problem to Satra Swagger as she gets to proc. Now, Amy's about to have her own burst, though, so if I can, just pass it to her. I'd really just A pass to her. As long as she doesn't die. Shoot, my strike was late. But Amy's got it. Yep, there you go. <laughs> she just really couldn't get a single strike for the last 10 seconds there, but it's okay. She recognized it, too, and we're just cascading off of this. It's like, you know, Luna's not getting any close for prize fighter. Aaron and I, I'd, I'd say we're doing 50 50. She's doing, like, she's doing a good job of, like, supporting Octavia, but it's just so, like, uh, it's just, you know, enemy Octavia just never gets to her flow state ever. Yikes. That's on me. Should I, should I have hit it straighter? Probably. Probably, yeah. Octavia's just gonna still have more speed than me. Yeah, 
Yikes. Can't believe I missed that. That's huge. Let's go. Yeah, just utilize the advantage we have now. Nice. That's it. Won't be much, though. <laughs> Thanks. Good stuff, teammates. That was a pretty nice game of just decent core control all around. Dubu, your patience was pretty darn good against some of their better assaults. And even when I did try to come defend, I think I grieved you a little bit more on some of those players. So sorry about that. But yeah, well-deserved MVP with your patience there. And like, and especially with your patience against like Octavia's burst at the end with her egoist and such. Great recognition of your win conditions, I mean, that's just nice and clean enough. And well, I did my job as era of shutting down their win condition whenever I could. Uh, just yeah, making sure Octavia's shrunk if I can. And just outperforming my fellow era. Good game all around.